Why has Washington sent his men to raid the frontier? Washington? To find somebody? A native woman who tried to take it from him? Well, he will not find me by you. Oh, fire! Get as far away from town as possible! Find shelter in the forest! Oya Nair sent us to collect the boughs of the Great Willow. To make the tea? Has she lost her senses? The tea's pitfalls overshadow its power. You must not do it. You will not succeed here. You? You survived. How astonishing. This time I'll make certain of your death. Mother! Washington. falls to you to make good on your mother's mistake. Journey to the Great Willow. Climb her. Retrieve the virgin boughs in her canopy. Drink their essence and gain the power to fight. To bring down this mad King George. Oyanir. Kill Arnold. Stop the destruction here. You must succeed. You escaped me once, but today you die. Find Benjamin Franklin in Boston. He can help you. We have to free him. Free him from where? Got you. I've got a present for you, your highness. A present? I think you'll be rather pleased. A very thoughtful Putnam. Do you know any of this, Mr. Franklin? No, it's news to me. What sort of present, General Putnam? Best sort. Come see. Rouse him! It's the one you blasted point-blank in the village, sire. Really? He survived. Remarkable. Yes, well, I've captured one myself, sire. In the next cell, a savage who joined that traitor, Sam Adams. Have them both beheaded. Along with a score of citizens, taken at random, as an example to all. Random citizens? Isn't that rather harsh, Your Majesty? Harsh, sir? Is it harsh to defend our freedoms? Is it harsh to extinguish those who would enslave us? Mr. Franklin, I suggest you examine your commitment to the cause, sir. Yes. Yes, of course, Your Majesty. Have the scaffolds made ready. My liege. Putnam, I fear Mr. Franklin is going soft. See to it that this so-called rebellion is crushed. And I will consider rearranging just who is in charge. I already have a plan, my lord. As for you... Let's see how you survive with the loss of your head. Hmm? <laughs> Carry on, Potnam. Yes, your highness. Stay sharp, soldier. You'll have a nice view tomorrow, with your head up high on a pike and all. Here. Oh, how 
geht. Ganandoko. Alive. Oh, my friend. I cannot believe you are here. And you? They said you had been killed, along with your mother. The clan mother brought me to health. Ganandogon. I was unable to protect my mother. I was unable to save the village. I'm very sorry, Don Hagedo. It has been difficult here as well. I fight with Sam Adams' rebels, but we are too few and too weak. But hurry, get me out. Washington is enslaving the people and looting everything. He ships the slaves and treasure to New York to build his palace. The rebels tried to free some slaves, but we were ambushed and I was captured. We're locked in. How'd you let that happen? Was it me? Christ. The king will have our heads for this. Got it. Thank you for getting me out of there. Get what you need, then we'll go. This is not everything. All right, let's find the rest. I need help! Wait here. I will let you through when it is clear. What is that? From the Red Willow. Ah. Uh, that is how you can move as you do. You went on a sky journey. Yes. What are you doing? If you want to defeat Washington, I will need the strength from the animal spirits. No. I defied my mother to go on that journey. It is too dangerous. I have no choice. But you're risking yourself for nothing. Even with the help of the wolf, I was taken captive. You don't know anything. Every journey holds a chance of meeting a new animal spirit. Wait. Every journey holds a chance of losing yourself. I understand the risk. I will take the journey.
La donna Gedo! Blue coat! I've sounded the alarm. Did you see a spirit? Are you alright? I never felt better. Break it! Break that goddamn door! Savages, kill them, or Washington will have our heads! Or at least mine. There is Franklin. Those are the savages. Attack! I'll take the blue coats. You stop Franklin. You... And where... I... I don't understand. Who am I? Why did Arnold say that you could help me? Is this me? It is. This is myself. I've come to myself. My God, what have I done? I don't care. 
care for those who meddle in my plans! You cannot reach me. Another magician's trick. Be gone! Escape as best you can! Why did you disobey me, my son? Your mother cannot help you now! I wanted to protect you! You failed to save your village. You failed to save your mother. Never again, Radon Hagedon! It's all falling away. Falling away. Falling away. What happened? I had him. I had Franklin. Then... Washington. They... They do not know. Washington? Maybe I don't have to free Franklin from a prison. I have to free him from Washington's power. Young man. Do you need a doctor? I found an ally right on again. Samuel Adams. Yeah. Do I know you? I... I know of you, sir. You are the famous man with the wolf hood. I admire the work you have done, and are doing now. We fight, but times are hard. We could use your assistance. Conrad Donagedon, we should all get out of here. We found a place that is safe. We'll be trapped in this alley if Franklin comes with reinforcements. Like last time. But then I get done. I told you're an extraordinary hunter. Able to track anything or anyone. I'd do my best. I could use such a man. I fought for years in the cause of freedom. I thought that Washington would lead us to a new age. But he turned. I had to start again. Sadly, our second rebellion is faltering. Sir, we're out of gunpowder. We must leave Boston. We'll be crushed altogether. But I wish to free some comrades to bring with us. They're loyal boys, all of them. But this time, we must avoid being surprised by that murderer, Franklin. If I had a man track Franklin down while we attempt to free our friends, it would disorient the Bluecoats and ensure our success. I have my own reasons to get Franklin. Capital. We have an accordance of desires. From time to time, we get important information from this tavern right here. Your appearance draws attention. But if you're able to mingle with the denizens, you should be able to discover Franklin's movements. I didn't think they served savages in here. That one should be in a slave camp. Anyone want to play? I'll take on all comers. Anyone want to play? I'll take on all comers. Care for a game? It's much better than cards, <laughs> don't you think? I remember. Hey, we... I am trying to concentrate. Fine, just being sociable. Sheesh.
Shimini, old Franklin's sending me out with another message. Oh, you're in for it now. And here's the worst of it. The message is for Putnam. Christ, you're a dead mackerel. Right. With either of those two, there's always some reason to end up flogged. Franklin will give you the lash, and then Putnam will try to outdo him. Something big is up. Only one ale for me. I have to get this to Putnam's lieutenant, or it's the whip. Or maybe worse. I must carefully steal the message from his pocket. General Putnam, there appears to be a misunderstanding regarding our respective positions and authorities. A personal meeting is called for at the docks tomorrow, 10 at night. The usual sentinels will secure our safety. Yours, Ben Franklin. Putnam doesn't get this message. I will miss my chance to trap Franklin. I must return it to the messenger's satchel. <laughs> If this is delivered, it will lead me to Franklin. Who are you? General Putnam is unable to meet with you. What? Well, this is absurd. Washington will hear of this. King Washington. His Majesty has removed himself to New York City to deal with the rebellion festering there. Removed himself? Why wasn't I informed? General Putnam asked me to deliver this proclamation from the King. This attests that Israel Putnam is heretofore to... What is this? From now on, you take orders from Putnam. Me? Take orders from him? I suggest you show me some respect, sir, or I'll have these men shoot you down. Sentinels! Sentinels? But...
Hold still. Come with me. Oh, my God, what have we done? I became a monster. It was as if Washington had some, some great power. Come on. He, he clouded my mind. He, he... I don't want to hear it. Come with me. Are you taking me somewhere to be killed? But, but I can help you now. You have to understand. It was as if my very thoughts were controlled. I simply could not think for myself. Don't kill me. Not now that I've come to my senses. I did monstrous things. Monstrous. I repent of those. I was literally a different man. My stars, these animals do your bidding. Astonishing. I let you live? My only wish is to atone for my wickedness. I will devote every moment to destroying the king. How? My dear man, I can be of enormous benefit. I served at Washington's side. I know his habits quite well. We will speak to Adams about this. Mr. Adams, I have a prisoner. Franklin. You bastard. Take him out. Have him shot. No, no, Sam! I've come to my senses. I want to help. The murder of my cousin John. The families of Dorchester. What about the old North Church? Which you burned. With everyone inside. All horrible. Do as I said. No! I believe he will help us. The only way to end this is to get to Washington, and Franklin knows Washington well. We've just learned that he is in New York. But if we could join Jefferson's rebels in Manhattan, we could attack the king together. How am I to escape the stranglehold around Boston? The docks are overrun with soldiers. Putnam is gone, and the captain at Boston Neck is secretly sympathetic to us. I am sure he will help us if he thinks he can get away with it. But he must help us in such a way that he will not be caught. Perhaps he could triple the soldiers' rum ration. That way we could catch them drunk, get Boston Neck, we'll break through. And once in New York, I can be a particular help. Don't want to hear it! I have created a very special means of protection for Washington's palace. An attack there would be completely unexpected. You can get me past these protections? You will need a medal of a specific weight. There's a blacksmith in town, loyal to me. He'll help you. This is absurd. I will get Franklin's medal and we will catch up with you. This is a fool's errand, my friend. But I hope to see you in New York. What can I do for you, mister? Benjamin Franklin has sent me. He asks something of you. Franklin? He tells me you have an unusual medal. He would like you to give that to me. Well, the thing about that is... The medal, please. A fella came along the other day, wanted his horse shot. Times being what they are, I was clean out of iron. Man's got a right to feed his children, don't he? Sorry, mister. You used it for horseshoes? Hi. Look good, too. Real good. Fellow rode away looking fine. Works at the Citadel, that one.
Ugh, it's hot in there. I stoked the brick oven. I've got to get the heat extremely high in order to melt the metal. Did you get it? I hope you have a crowbar. What for? Salmon gun and Dogon have gone with what's left of the men to Boston Neck. I hope they make it. We should join them as soon as we can. First, I must melt this down. Then I need the diagram of my design. I left it with an officer as a kind of insurance policy. He can almost always be found at the tavern. Get that? And I can file this shape to the correct position. Look at that outfit. Benjamin Franklin sent me to you. Sorry, my friend. You want something? You've got to beat me. I do not have a lot of time. That's my condition. Very well. But let's make it quick. Did you hear about the little fracas went down tonight? It was quite a battle. Battle is being generous. More like a massacre. Bunch of fellas got suckered by Putnam. Pretty funny. What do you mean, got suckered? Shooting fish in a barrel, really. Dumb fish. What are you talking about? Putnam started a rumor that the captain of the guard was friendly to the rebels. Hilarious. What? Yep. Old Putnam tricked those redcoats into coming out in a group to Boston Neck. Then just mowed those stupid saps down. Do you know this for a fact? I was there. I saw Adams take his last breath. That's it. Get him, boys.
riddance to those louts. They never paid anyway. Was that checker player telling the truth? Did Adams run into a trap? I must find out. That's from Sam's uniform. Dried blood. Ganondogon's tomahawk. Are these... Are these his fingers? I have to be certain. Someone must have seen this. Terrible. The rebels were overwhelmed, outnumbered four to one. Never seen such slaughter. Piteous. Piteous slaughter. This should get us close to Washington. By heavens, what happened? Boston Neck was a trap set by Putnam. And Adams. Cannon Dogon. Everyone killed. Killed? We'll be next. We've got to get out of here. The land routes are cut off. We must escape by sea. Yes, by sea. I know of an excellent ship, but I'm too well known to move about freely. I will find you a disguise. Excellent idea. In the meanwhile, give me the diagram. I'll file this metal to precision. Bit of a tight fit, you know. How do I look? Ridiculous. 
You don't have to be so honest. Hmm. Oh dear, trouble ahead. Look, here's one of us. Come along. We're headed to the tavern. You can buy us a mug of flip. Then <laughs> toast us, huh? <laughs> Mr. Faulkner. Sir. Who's that? Do I... Franklin? Don't let the disguise fool you. Oh, God damn it! <laughs> Your men stole my ship, you shite! Easy, Mr. Faulkner. Mr. Franklin is on the side of the rebels now. We need your help. And why should I? You will get your ship back. Ha! <laughs> the goddamn wharf's too heavily guarded! I can change that if you tell me what needs to be done. Well, let's see. I'll need you to untie the killer so it's all set to go. Meantime, I can scare you up a small crew. Then we'll rush the guards and set sail. The Aquila is ready. Do you have a crew? 
They're here. Can they fight? They're sailors. They do nothing but fight. Let's go. Them off until you're ready to sail. Swim, lad, swim. Snipers, you need to stop them. They're shooting at Faulkner. Over here! <gasps> one move, just one move, and he's dead. Call back your men and give yourself up! Fuerza de la Go! Shut it! Uh. I've done such horrible deeds. It's the scepter, but that's no excuse. Every man holds evil deep within. The apple just brought it out. <gasps> Your only chance was to leave from the docks. You kept turning the wheel. Ganondokon, I do not care. Land ho! Look at that. <laughs> 